Each week here at WLKY, we will tell you about a community champion. Today, we are focusing on a person working at a grassroots level to bridge the gap in the community. Pamela Haynes is the owner of Sweet Peaches Restaurant, which sits in the heart of West Louisville. But as WLKY's Stefan Dingle shows us, Haynes is doing even more to impact her community. Here at the corner of Muhammad Ali Boulevard and 18th Street sits a beacon of hope for the community. Now it goes beyond the sweet smells of soul food that spreads from Sweet Peach's restaurant. In fact, it is the bright spirit of the owner that says she wants to give a chance to a community that feels forgotten. The need in this community is so awesome. It's how I started out, yeah. but it has fulfilled me. Yeah. This community has delivered me and made me who I am. Found your purpose. I found my purpose. A purpose that inspired Pamela Haynes to go far beyond providing a home-cooked meal to a community in need. Her love and compassion doesn't discriminate either. Sometimes she's feeding the homeless, someone just out of jail, or children, which seems to be her soft spot. The children walked up and down the streets in the summertime. I said, why, why don't these kids have anywhere to, where to go, anything to do? And so that inspired me to open the tutoring center upstairs. This is how it was. It wasn't like this. Pamela emptied her savings account to renovate the learning space where she would talk and get to know several young people who walked by her restaurant. In speaking with them, she noticed there was another need that was all too familiar to her own childhood. Uh, mom had to work late last night. She wasn't able to wash my clothes. And so you don't want to go to school with dirty clothes? I can remember having dirty clothes. Did Miss Tina, she got two grandkids. Make sure you get her grandkids clothes. All right, got them. She reached out to Councilwoman Barbara Sexton Smith, who helped Pamela get a donated washer and dryer for her tutoring center. It now fills a critical need for these children. And some of them, they didn't even want their mom to know they were getting their clothes washed. Well, put it in your backpack and we'll wash them. And I showed them, I would show them how to fold them and roll them. So nobody would know they have clean clothes in their backpack. And then they would take them home. And then the next thing I knew, the mom was coming to wash the clothes. Bridging the gap of pride versus a need. Pamela Haynes is a champion in her West End community by simply meeting those who need help exactly where they are. I ain't too proud to beg. I won't beg for myself, but I will beg to help a little person, to help a, a single mom, and it's so many of them out here, to get a meal for their, for their family for Christmas, to get clean school clothes, to buy my whole 401k is spent on school clothes for somebody else. And I'm completely satisfied with what I do, and that's all I need. In West Louisville, Stefan Dingle, WLKY News. Over the Christmas holiday, someone broke into the tutoring center and stole all of the laptops. There's a link to GoFundMe to help replace the items on WLKY.com. And if you'd like to nominate a community champion for us to feature, just send us a message on the WLKY Facebook page.